Big news in the crypto space, BlackRock, the global asset giant, is dominating Bitcoin, surpassing MicroStrategy in holdings. With a recent purchase of 12,600 Bitcoins, BlackRock's total stash now hits 196,000, signaling a massive vote of confidence. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and let's start. And we're starting off with, it's official, 70,000 Bitcoin before the 2024 halving before CIRP and before significant M2 growth, what does it mean? $800 trillion of fiat assets are about to try to get an allocation to Bitcoin which is only $1.3 trillion today. And much of that is $1.3 trillion is not for sale. Maybe him being a crypto influencer was the confirmation of the start of the parabola phase on Bitcoin and the entire market. Bitcoin is up 46% since the GM paused and or maybe him being a crypto influencer on that day was just a coincidence, right? Right? So February 12th, 2024, just before Doge also had its big weekly breakout, must be coincidence or low. Yeah, that's what we have. When there's not even enough Bitcoin for sale, billionaires will offer anything to own some and you'll be able to get houses for 001 bitcoin cars for 001 bitcoin and a month of groceries for one uh, uh with four zeros bitcoin and they will give you everything you need because you have what they want the Bitcoin price has historically rallied for approximately 280-300 days and once breaking its previous autumn high. If Bitcoin goes into a parabolic phase soon, this could be a sign that the price will top out sooner than many anticipate and thus not following the traditional 4-year cycle. This could mean a price top could come in the latter part of this year or potentially sooner. In my view, the next 4-6 weeks are critical to this potential outcome as therefore market participants should keep a close eye on this. A trader investor should always be open to changing their view of the market as it unfolds. Remember, the name of the game is to come out alive and in profit. The next stop we go for, most uh, Bitcoin impulsive bull run incoming and the um, fact that a weekly moving average 100 and weekly moving average 200 crossed for the first time in history might have triggered the most impulsive bull run in we have ever seen so far. And it shows that Bitcoin already have reached a new all-time high before halving for the first time as well, 2024 could be even brighter than we think. The next stop we go for. At a 1450 sats per dollar, $69,000 per Bitcoin, here what do you uh, hourly wage denominating, denominated in terms of Bitcoin looks like? 15 an hour, 21,750 sats, $20 an hour, 29,000 sats an hour, uh, 25 uh, uh, per dollars per hour, 36,250 sats, and $100 per hour is $145,000 a sats, so you can check it out by yourself if you want to know your salary. Bitcoin ETF tracking 182,000 Bitcoins net inflow year to date, 120,000 Bitcoins in the last 30 days, on pace for the 300k inflows by halving day, and a recent 120,000 inflows led at 45% price surge in Bitcoin, so constant pace implied $99,000 by halving day. Looks pretty bullish. The next stop, Bitcoin is hitting a new autumn highs and the average person still doesn't care. Retail is slowly returning but nowhere near previous cycles and that's what we could see and guy go out of that. Just in, BlackRock spot Bitcoin ETF has surpassed MicroStrategy's Bitcoin holdings as iBeat currently holds 196,089 Bitcoins compared to MicroStrategy's 193,000 as well. Let's go for more. BlackRock outpaces MicroStrategy in both Bitcoin holdings. So BlackRock, the world's largest asset manager, has significantly increased in Bitcoin holdings surpassing Michael Saylor's MicroStrategy. With a recent purchase of 12,600 Bitcoins, BlackRock's total Bitcoin stash now stands at the monumental 196,000. After 40 trading days, BlackRock's Bitcoin ETF holds more Bitcoin than MicroStrategy, total 15 capital. So in an unprecedented move, BlackRock's recent acquisition of 12,600 Bitcoins propels its holdings past MicroStrategy's mar marking a significant shift in the landscape of the institutional investments in cryptocurrencies. As the search of BlackRock's Bitcoin portfolio, in a strategic accumulation, BlackRock has added a whooping 12,600 Bitcoins worth 
worth $842 million to its portfolios. This addition has capitulated in a total Bitcoin holdings to 196,000 Bitcoins valued at over $12.3 billion. And the accumulation underscores BlackRock's bullish stance on Bitcoin and its commitment to integrating digital assets into traditional investment portfolios. As according to HODL 15 Capital, this milestone achievement has positioned BlackRock as the leading institutional holder of Bitcoin, surpassing the previous leading MicroStrategy's holdings. And comparative insights, BlackRock versus MicroStrategy. So the race for Bitcoin dominance between BlackRock and MicroStrategy has been closely monitored by the crypto community, while MicroStrategy under Michael Saylor's leadership has been a vocal advocate for Bitcoin acquiring an additional 3,000 Bitcoins last month for approximately $155 million, BlackRock's recent activities have shifted the balances, with BlackRock's total holdings now at 196,000 Bitcoins compared to the MicroStrategy's 193,000 Bitcoins, the implication for the future of the institutional investment in cryptocurrencies are profound. Both entities have showcased a strong belief in a Bitcoin's value proposition, as yet BlackRock's recent high acquisition highlights a growing trend of traditional financial giants actively participating in the cryptocurrency market. As a market impact and future outlook, BlackRock's substantial investment in Bitcoin comes at a time when the cryptocurrency is experiencing significant inflows, particularly in the spot Bitcoin ETFs as the iShares Bitcoin Trust by BlackRock witnessed its highest inflows of $788 million on March 5th, indicating a strong institutional interest in Bitcoin, as this trend is reflective of a broader acceptance of cryptocurrencies within the traditional financial sectors, suggesting the potential shift towards more substantial investments in digital assets by major financial institutions. In conclusion, we have that a recent developments in BlackRock's Bitcoin strategy not only signify its confidence in digital assets, but also mark a pivotal moment in the adoption of the cryptocurrencies by institutional investors as a BlackRock takes the lead in Bitcoin holdings, surpassing MicroStrategy, as the crypto market may witness increased interest and investment from other traditional financial institutions, as this shift represents a significant milestone in the journey of Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies towards mainstream financial recognition and acceptance, paving the way for a new era in crypto asset management. The next we go for, here are the 10 firms with the largest Bitcoin portfolios. So from MicroStrategy to Coinbase, here are the 10 firms that hold the most Bitcoin in portfolios. As we could see, there's the MicroStrategy with its $4 billion in, as well as next, Galaxy Digital Holdings with $700 million of Bitcoin treasury, Voyager Digital LTD with 500 million euros in it, Tesla with $1.5 billion in cryptocurrency, whose CEO is Elon Musk as we know, Marathon Digital Holdings with $218 million worth of Bitcoin, Block Inc. with $174 million worth of Bitcoin in treasuries, and basically the Coinbase with $230 million and $298 million amidst the market volatility and regulatory scrutiny. But as ETFs add up, we could see the BlackRock and Fidelity catching up to this, as well as Black BlackRock finally breaks the holdings of MicroStrategy and holding way more than that. But we already talked about this as the largest firm, so I don't think that we can call BlackRock a firm because they're not buying it for themselves, they're buying it for ETF, so I can't claim it actually to be a company as itself. Even if it is, we still understand that it's for ETFs and I can claim that this is the 10 largest portfolios right there out of the firms. So that's kind of all the information we got on today's video. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share. See you in the next one and peace.